how do you have peace? The Bible is very clear. Romans chapter 5, verse 1. Therefore, having been justified by faith, we have peace with God through our Lord Jesus Christ. Notice, you cannot have peace until you have peace with God. I'm not talking about the peace of God. I'm first talking about peace with God. Because the Bible says all of us have sinned. We have done something against God. The Bible talks about there's a separation between man and God. And that's why we don't have that peace. But you need to be at peace with God first. That means once upon a time, we were set apart. There's animosity between my life and God. One day, I surrendered my life to the Lord. There can be no peace until you surrender. Once I surrendered my life to the Lord, I said, Lord, I surrender. I've been fighting against you. I've been running my own life. I've been self-seeking. And that's why the Beatitudes begin with, blessed are the poor in spirit. Brokenness. Blessed are those who mourn for their sin. Blessed are those who hunger and thirst after righteousness. Once you surrender, the Bible says you have been justified. The word justified means you are declared not guilty anymore. Therefore, to be a peacemaker, the assumption is this. You better experience peace with God first. So how do you have peace with God? How? Look, we have peace with God through our Lord Jesus Christ. Through Jesus. How? By faith. Having been justified by faith. What is the meaning of that? That means you stop trusting in yourself. You say, Lord, no matter how hard I try, I can never be good enough. I can never please you enough. I am not righteous. I need you. 